Welcome back to Jojo's Land and it's Jojo here with something brand new for you in the box and uh, it's something quite exciting this time we are taking a look at the lavalier set the Saramonic lavaliers now this these are quite known to this, uh, to this date and uh, are quite appreciated as being some of the best uh, lavaliers that you can pick up so uh, can't wait to get down into this box and uh, see what's inside. Now it's time to have a look at these things. So let's check out and see what treasures we can find in this box today. Okay, so that's quite an interesting packing. This looks rather sturdy. Oh, look at that cardboard there. Hmm. Interesting way to pack this. It does feel sturdy. I think it offers good protection for what's inside. Oh, is that Velcro? Yeah, it's Velcro. Hmm. That sounded about right. Okay, so we do have a lot of things going on in here. And uh, let's go through it and see see what's going on. First thing you can see, it's a, a little manual here, some kind of user manual. We won't take a look at that. Just for the sake of the video, we're going to remove it though. Oh, okay, what is this? This is a warranty card for Santa Monica International. Okay, so I guess... You need to register this product or something in order to, to get that warranty. But let's go to what really interests us. Now we have a lot of compartments and a lot of little things and I just can't wait to get through them. Well, the first thing I can see here, I think this is a... Whoa, whoa, whoa this is heavy. Man, these are heavy, I can tell you that. Okay, so the Saramonic Transmitter TX9, that's the way it looks. And these, I can tell you one thing, these are really heavy, they feel really sturdy and well built. Actually, I believe this, is, uh, this encasing is not some kind of metal, maybe it's aluminium, I think. Yeah, listen to that, I think it's aluminium. Then we have... And there is another one, of course. So we have another one of these uh, emitters. The Saramonic Transmitter TX9. Same, uh, same as the other one. These antennas seem to be a bit wiggly jiggly. And uh, I'm fine with that. These should be a bit elastic, so you won't be able to break something like this when you're wearing it, maybe on your belt or something like that. What else? We have another unit in here, another unit in this box, and uh, I think this is actually the receiver unit. Yes, this actually is the receiver unit. It has two antennas. Okay, so in what I'm guessing, it's one antenna for each of the two channels that you you can uh, you can have with this. So. Yeah, this should work with uh, with both channels simultaneously. It's quite interesting, same sturdy, well-built, really, really heavy construction. And then here you have an output and a phone. I believe the output you will use to actually connect this to your camera. And uh, the phone maybe could be some sort of a preview of your recording of or your quality of sound. This is actually the cable you are going to need to connect your receiver to your camera. Okay, so actually what we have here, I think this is, uh, no, it's for sure. This is a cable that will allow you to connect some kind of uh, classical microphone, the, the hand type of microphone, and you, then you just plug this in it, and then you have that sound source going to your transmitter here. So I think these actually are the lavaliers themselves. 
and okay so we have about one meter or so of cable there's a little strap i think this is uh, actually kind of a metallic hook here it's a metallic clamp so i will take you i'll let you take a closer look to this clamp that's good this metal it's not gonna break you know when you wear this or actually accidentally try to drag it or something it's gonna hold on in there and uh, looks really good we have another one of these things it's pretty much identical to the to the first one I showed you so I'm to turn into that the old good old silica gel keeps your tech dry and uh, yeah apparently I find it in every box I'll show you a closer look and how these clips actually work I can tell you it really feels really great quality and the clip also feels great to the touch and uh, looks very practical also. We have a little tiny foot here. Now this comes in the package and it will actually help you strap these things to either a hot shoe like this one so you can strap it to a camera or you can either go ahead and put this on a tripod yeah so i think you just have to slide this from the back as you can see here slide it slide it all the way to the front there you go a nice satisfying click holds everything into place so okay how we can put this on the camera here well we're going to use this hot shoe as i said before i guess i'll put the antennas frontwards that's where I'm going to have my mic and I'm going to be recording next we need this cable and uh, we do need this to actually connect it connect our receiver to our cameras audio input now to do that we're just going to look for the output jack put this in there screw this uh, safety feature here so this will not get removed accidentally and it's quite sturdy actually I'd say now we have actually installed the receiver to our camera and I think it's about time we power this on whoa sorry morning logo that's really cool Okay, so it does show two groups here. It, it has group A and group B. I would believe A and B would be assigned to the two receivers. I'll just let you see that a bit up close. How that looks like. We are going to connect our lavalier microphone to this transmitter. And uh, in order to do this, we just put our jack in in the mic port right there. Screw this safety in, so we are sure that this will not be accidentally removed while actually wearing this, the mic itself. That looks quite safe, quite sturdy as well. And we have the mic right here. So let's power this thing up. Same nice logo startup as uh, with, the, with the receiver. So now our transmitter is powered on. Oh, and this is really interesting. Now this this actually connected in a full automatic way to my receiver. That's quite interesting and awesome, I think, because you know you're gonna use this a lot. You don't want to really do a lot of setup and setting each time you're gonna use it. And this automatical connect looks amazing and uh, I think it's something of a really good feature so in order to complete this test I just strapped one of these bad boys to myself and what you can hear now it's actually the lavalier working now this is the quality of the sound and uh, I bet it's quite completely different to what you heard before coming back to that uh, Swave, great voice of Jojo. <laughs> 
Jojo does not sing. Mm -hmm. What about that, guys? Yeah, thanks for the applause. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Smile and wave, yeah. The great sound. This is how you achieve it. You get one of these sarmonic things and uh, you just use it and then you go. You're a professional. You're a professional movie star. You're gonna be maybe starting a career in television. Who knows, this could be the beginning, getting these things. Now, if you enjoyed this video as much as I did actually filming it, it will be really, really cool and helpful for me if you would click that subscribe button right over there and do hit that little bell icon. Now, that little bell icon will help you get notifications from our channel whenever we have new uploads, whenever Jojo comes with an exciting new piece of tech you want to see, or an exciting new figure, and that will really help you stay up to date and will also help me a great deal. And until next time, Jojo out. Keep it cool, wave to the audience. Wave, smile and wave, boys. Smile and wave, boys.